This is Frankenstein's experiment. Now we designed this around Mary Shelley's original Frankenstein script. And the, she described kind of this yellowy flesh, or just kind of yellowy green. And then gray eyes, black hair, very tall. And this is what he does. It comes with everything, the sound, the control systems, fog machine, lighting effects. And so it's a complete package and it's all heavy metal, as usual, bulletproof. Then we've got Von Front do the costume, which they do such a great job with the shades, a little leather accents and things. We hired Greg Dykstra. He, he was worked for Pixar for 23 years. So he did many of the characters for Pixar. And he came out and sculpted, I think about this much of him. Uh, and we added the, the rest of his stomach and he worked on the hands. We finished the hands, uh, but Greg did a beautiful job and he's worked for so many people, done so much stuff. And it was fun having him out to work on him. Let me tell you, the ground shakes when he goes off. <laughs> There's a lot of weight moved around. In fact, if you get this, you might want to figure out how to kind of anchor it with sandbags or spikes or something, because in the filming of this, he's moved around quite a bit. These arms, we were thinking, you know, we wanted to make him scary, reach out and grab at you, but we didn't want it to hurt anybody. So we used this rubber conveyor belt stuff and we put it in his arms this way so they would they would have strength lifting and then we twist them at the arms so if somebody's standing right in front of them and he hits them they just burp they just bend they just i mean they'll notice it there's no metal the metal is way back here now we kind of like the old world just solid lighting but we pick this lighting effects thing and it can do different stuff so you can pick what color you want so you could you can go uh, red, yellow, green, blue, whatever. Or you can go for special effects. And there's a couple of pretty cool ones. Because it's it's like it's got a power shortage and things. And so he's run by 110. And you just need air, compressed air, and 110 power. The program's on it. The sound's on it. Everything is there. And uh, he's ready to go. Frankenstein's experiment.